Yes, it's not much, it's just a little bit of rubbish he wants to get rid of against the old TV unit. Now my wheel's in motion and my window's open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way, I can feel it in the air. Here I go! everyone and welcome to today's vlog hope everyone is doing okay today yes i thought i'll stop the vlog off outside actually because it's not too bad out here obviously a bit windy if you can from here and i see the blue sky a bit cloudy anyway yes yeah, get back in the warm i think anyway yes yeah, so it's the calm before the storm is so to speak today yeah so last night we had storm Dudley it wasn't too bad to be honest if you're a bit windy but it didn't cause no major damage or nothing like that which is great I uh, just feel sorry for the people that have like lost power or had their homes damaged I think it was more up north that one but for us tomorrow it's going to be storm Eunice and she is going to be a big big storm anything up to 100 mile an hour winds for this local area so yeah so um we said we're not going out tomorrow. Normally on the Friday I go around the market, help my dad. But he said he's not going out in it tomorrow. Be honest with you, I'm not going out in it tomorrow. It just isn't worth it. But luckily tomorrow it's coming in the daytime rather than at night. So yeah, so that definitely is an advantage. Well, so we've got a torch coming just in case it does come at night and we do lose power. But hopefully, fingers crossed it, it will die down. But yes, yeah, so anyway, so like I said, we've tied everything down. Ben's trampoline is actually tied to... This great thing out here is so that that can't move. And we're also going to try and see if we're going to try and find the anchor kit for the trampoline to anchor it down into the ground. So I hope that should help as well. But somehow, it's 14 foot trampoline. It's got to be some real big, massive winds to move that. But yeah, yeah so like I said, today is just going to be one of those lazy, chill out days. We've got nothing special planned or nothing like that. So I don't know if we might do a two days worth of vlog. I think it all depends how much I actually film today as well. So I've got, I've got a bit of washing to get done, but you don't see me doing my washing because it's a bit boring. But anyway, kids went off to school absolutely fine. But first off for me now is to make a cup of tea and put the dishwasher on. Yes, it's not much. It's just a little bit of rubbish he wants to get rid of against the old TV unit, really. And Sam's old girl next that actually broke. The little unit here which has my old CDs on it, which just fell apart. And then, do you want to get rid of these old trampoline poles or not? Yeah, they're going as well. They're going as well, because they're not exactly the um, greatest, were they? So we're going to get this in the tip, get this to the tip. Um, and basically, today, like I said, it's just calm for the storm today, isn't it? Was that going to fit in a car like that, or would they have to break that down? But break it, I don't know. It might fit in a car like that. Just have to give it a go, see how it goes. That's what you can see, we've managed to get everything watered in the boot of the car, which is good actually. At least with the old car, it is I've got a big massive boot space on it. So yeah, so we're just going to get the tip now. And then obviously when we come back, we're going to try and secure the garden up a little bit more. Yes, yeah, so we just got back from the tip and do, anyway, just as well. Because we've only been in the door about two minutes and the ambulance on the guy turns up. So we've got a nice big torch there, haven't we, just in case. Oh, there we are, right? That'd be good for Ben. Some century chewing necklaces, because I don't know, is chewing maybe like... Give, maybe you should give him one of those when he's going to school. Chew on. That might be an idea. Have, let him have one. Yeah, of course they will. School will let him have one of them, won't they? I mean the bus. Oh, the bus. Yeah, of course the bus will let him have one of them. Yeah. yeah. They, used to, they used to let him take his friend to school every day. He's yes. going for a stage to bang his head. Yes. So these will protect his head a little bit. So yeah, so I'll get one of these out in a minute, see what these are actually like. He's got it, look, see, we're all too with sensory toys for autism, where the high quality tear resistant. So, yeah, look, reduction of anxiety. So, he'll probably enjoy 
Are these necklaces kind of breakaway class extra safety for your kids? I tell you, these would be perfect for Ben because this has got like a tough thing on it. You know what I mean? Like his Lego ones he's got, his um, Lego Century shoes, which you've probably seen, they're quite poxy because they're really thin and stuff. but these ones no tell you what he won't destroy one of these in a day so yes it's got so my actually what i probably might do is on his lanyard i might put one of these on his lanyard because would you believe school said he doesn't really chew much at school it's just here, it's just here isn't it yeah. so yeah as you can see and probably hear the wind's picking up already isn't it it definitely the wind has definitely got worse over the course of the day. Hey, what are you doing to Ben's trampoline? Using these to tie down. Oh yeah? Tie down. What to tie it down to make sure it doesn't go anywhere could not be a Ben be like. I can't imagine the wind blowing up a 14 foot trampoline, you know what I mean? And the thing is you've actually tied it to the thing there anyway. You know, just being over cautious, which is fair enough, no, isn't it? Yeah, I've got no potential for any leaves on them trees. Yeah, that's the thing, yeah, because the, the trees haven't got their leaves on. Oh, that's fair enough, but who knows? They might be down soon, hopefully. But anyway, yeah, also what we have done is just moved the bits by the back gate as well. And we've actually moved my glass patio table from here, haven't we? Because that was glass, and just imagine that going and flying. We just pushed the sand pit. Right against here. I do you think my pots would be right underneath. Yeah, they'll be fine. They'll be fine underneath, won't they? Again, they're only cheap to buy. If they go walk, it's a little bit damaged, you know what I mean? So, what about all the toys in the sandpit? Again, they should be fine, shouldn't they? I'll take it in if you want. Can I take it in? Yeah, yeah I think that'd be best thing to do because you know, in the summer, Ben loves his little sandpit, doesn't he? Yeah, but leave yeah, leave the watering can, there's things underneath, they should be fine. Yeah, what is? Yeah. Oh, the watering can, yeah, that's gonna have to go flying. Yeah, take it in. Yeah, well, you've done your best with it, and you? you put all those things on underneath it, you know what I mean? Like I said, I can't imagine it blowing away to be honest with you. Only one thing Stephen has noticed, the new net is torn already just here. Was well, that a door how that's torn, do you? So it might have been from the storm as well. So anyway, let's get back in the water before it gets cold. Anyway, my sweeter, you had a good day at school today. And you tomorrow to go, and then you're on half ten then for the week, aren't you? Tell you what, if you'll come home from school and you're absolutely lovely and warm. You're not told at all, are you? He's just tucking into his um puffs and some of these vegetable stick things we got him yesterday. Are they nice? Do you like them? Well, I'm not mad. We've got tomorrow to go. Yeah, tomorrow to go. What were those, what were those vegetable sticks? Kale and what? She had them on carrot, wasn't it? We were. He seems to be enjoying them anyway, which is good. So. Monday, Monday. If only you could tell us what you've done at school. But Mummy spoke to your teacher in the college part of the school today. Yeah, and she said you absolutely loved it in there, didn't you? You done really, really well. When you went around Sainsbury's last week, you loved looking around Sainsbury's and getting some bits and pieces off the shelf you wanted, didn't you? One day, mummy. What's the matter? One day we'll have um, something on the big screen, like a computer or something. Am I doing? I'm to so, yeah. So, if you could tell us, say, what you've done. But, yeah, we've got lots of things planned for next week, haven't we? Hope, fingers crossed, the weather won't spoil it, but we'll just have to cross... That wish if it happens, won't we? Oh, we might get my... right, right. So, anyway, Sita, do you have a good day? Yeah. What have you done today? I've been doing my two. It was my. I'm having fun tonight. I know, yeah, we're having fun tonight. Have we, yeah, what have we been doing at school today? Today, I've been busy. Yeah. I did this... PE, and I did PE today, and everything. And everything, yeah. What are the lessons you've done then, apart from PE? Um, today in PA, uh, today in PA, I did some yoga. You like yoga, don't you? Yeah. Classic yoga. So I feel like I teach probably how to do yoga. And what are the lessons you've done from PA? Yeah. Um, I've been busy. You've been busy. It's all get out of you. You're tired a bit late, won't you? So, hey, that's, you that's the yoga I do at school, Mum, out there. I do, you're sir. 
Oh, I do cosmic kid yoga. Yeah. That sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Sounds for is that the thing you is that the thing I was watching this morning? No, this afternoon. What the Zen Den thing? Yeah. Yeah. And look, my mate, it's already I always described to it. Well, you described to it. Okay, that's good then. So, anyway, did you go outside to play today, or was it too cold yeah. and too windy? Oh uh, yeah. I I, I went outside to play. Did I you? always I subscribed to the school things. Yeah, I know I you do. I always subscribed to this and sweat scars yeah. and that. Yeah, so I subscribed to the school thing is, there's possibilities, Sam, you know, tomorrow that you won't be able to go outside and play. You know that, don't you? Because of the wind. Because of the wind, yeah, it's too windy. Yeah. What are you after, darling? Have you got your drink now? Yeah, did you enjoy your snacks? Don't drink it too quickly, sweet time, or she'll get wind. <laughs> oh, bless him. She's giving me your bow. Do you want some more? Come on, then. Give it to Daddy, then. Daddy, get you some more. Give it to Daddy. Bless him. He picked his bowl up off the floor himself. Here we go. I got your pies to get two hours on Saturday, sweet up. Go on then, so what have you done with them? See if he took some into his bowl like he done yesterday. Daddy, Give him to him like that. Have yeah, he is. Daddy, Bless him. Daddy. Aren't you clever boy? Is it small now? Yeah, aren't Daddy, you a clever boy for doing that? Yeah. Daddy, We've, um, Daddy, we strapped a trampoline that. down, Sammy, so yeah. I hope your fingers crossed it, Ben, it won't fly away. Sammy, you ain't got no stuff for pasta, darling. Um, I don't know why I've got the I'll stuff for pasta. Past we have yeah. pasta tomorrow night, yeah? No, don't bite that bowl! bowl. Well, guys, that brings Thursday's vlog to a close, and yet we're all prepared. I've tied down Ben's trampoline as best as I could and um, moved all the bins into the little alcove round by the back gate so they don't go start going flying all over the garden. Yeah, so everyone out there that who, who's in these amber or red warning areas, take heed to the warning guys because you know red means danger to life so please don't go out there and you know go near the sea or anything like that because we're expecting some really bad conditions down in that area tomorrow and uh, over where we are it's going to be amber warning so the strongest winds are going to come around seven in the morning so who knows if the boys will go to school yet it all depends if school send us a text message to say it's too dangerous for them to go who knows, so we'll see what happens. But anyway, the weather's not looking great now for the next few days. Well, we're still in an iron about Sunday at the moment because we reckon there could be yet another storm on Sunday. So that's going to be really not, not an interesting thing. You know, I was hoping that the weather was going to calm down for when they were going to be off, but I guess not. So we'll see how it happens. Anyway, thanks very much for watching, guys. Take care, stay safe, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.